Ephraim, who are here, where is Christomo? As a young coming in, I'm Ray, Bijan, young papa, a good son, Nemo, Mamunia, Quavan. Now, I'm Sir Mapamacho, a Samra, Yediso, a bar half Friday, Yen to June. If I put the Baba Cope, I'll be better to Juma. You can harm, won't he? You better to Juma, we're very young about our Cope, I'll bet me a better to Juma. My name, we have to abide by the law, Pamacho. We have to keep to our distances. Say, say, oh, I think I knew you'll be of a band with me, Jabon. This is how last Friday we buy a bear back one, and this is the procedure. You bear yet, I'm sorry, Kakra, you're to Juma, you'll find the Baba. If a man break a cry, be a feeder, no, near the penny, and leave it me pay one tribute. Ain't he never marked time a cry, you'll be a person who can be be no, a man who can be a worker, be a cry. If ye are sorry in a year, I fear a bear viewing. A viewing, no, I was a funeral or better answer. When we judge our honor, I bear, and I point to say, if ye, 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 Na mama ini mrano so na they say abang mrano we have to be law abiding. Say we be busy say yaya yaya ye di ni mono na odi asam be brave. Mama inti let's listen to some sentences from scripture. I am the resurrection and the life, says the Lord. Those who have faith in me shall live, even though they die. No one who lives and has faith in me shall ever die. God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten to the Son, that everyone who has faith in him should not perish. They have eternal life. Amen. 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 When you tell this word, made us my in aye. So, no, me young coupon and me boaf. No, me, you don't young coupon so, or not tom, not do ye. Ninchilla or nam a tom so, a dear shire in tea true, and ye papa. A man qua. The vampire do young coupon say, or enquire with the man. In Shroud, this Shroud will be a city through our Remo, a memo, a Jumemo. Why be brave? I may be a safe woman until we are see uncle. It's left legacy in the world. You can lay hands on his works. Just enjoy God's blessing. Let's pray. I want to sing along. Yes, oh, angels. I'm singing. I'm singing along. The Father, you know, say you can come. Only we according to the law. Only one person can sing. Please.
in everything as we know. Incorporate. With all this in mind, what are we to say? If God is on our side, but I'm convinced that there's nothing in death or life. Nothing in all creation that can separate us from the love of God in Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. Amen. That is the message for us. There's nothing. Whatever has happened, we know that our Father here has come, left the legacies, and always we used to say, it's not the age, it's that the number, but what you leave behind. He has left a lot behind. At this moment, I want to call anybody who wants to say, who can lead us once or to sing a song for us? I know the Pentecost people are not here. Uh, they have somebody. Can you come and sing one song for us, please? says the scripture reminds us, listen, I will unfold a mystery. We shall not all die. 
They shall all be changed in a flash, in the twinkle of an eye, at the last trumpet call. For the trumpet will sound, and the dead will rise, imperishable, and we shall be changed. Brothers and sisters, the assurance today is that is not dead. The dust, this body is for dust. But the soul will continue to live. And that is the remind for us. That is the assurance for us today. So while we are here today, just to see the remains, the dust, I will go to the dust. But let's hold on to that faith that he's still alive. At this moment, I, as I said earlier, um, we are going to, we are waiting for the Pentecost, but before that, I'm going to ask anybody, one or two people, three minutes, if you want to say anything, pay a little tribute, because maybe Friday there will be no time for us to pay tribute. Anybody who want to say one or two things, something about it? Just a short three minutes. Yeah, um, I'm reading this um, tribute on behalf of uh, Sejid Masi, Kru Yeku. Sejid Masi is a town in, in the Ashanti region, and that's where Mr. T was born. Uh, most of us, including me and myself, didn't know Mr. T until this for the formation of this um, union, of which he was one of the founding members. Um, he's been a very important person for the citizens of this union. Mr. T had already been in Europe where he studied and became a chartered accountant. He returned to Ghana and worked in the jute factory until he was arrested and incarcerated by the Rawlings uh, regime. He was kept in jail for a short period and was released without any charges. He then returned to London and formed his own practice at Dawson in East London. Um, he was adored, adored by members of this union because of his generosity and his selflessness. Everybody's problem became his problem. He traveled the length and breadth of England. He traveled from London to Manchester, London to Colchester, and London to Birmingham and beyond. Whenever there was a problem in a family, particularly regarding the breakdown of marriages, he was there assist to solve these problems. He was there when a new child has been born and he has to be christened in a traditional way. Now because of all these things that he did, he earned the title of Abu Zakuin, which means head of the family. Now since this, this union was formed, the first member we lost, his name is Abraham. It was through his effort that the body was repatriated to Ghana. And the second person who died as a member of the union, his name is Charles. Mr. Oti also played, again played a very important role in the repatriation of the body to Ghana. Now the irony is that the man who has been responsible for all these repatriations decided that um, when he dies, his remains should be kept in London here. The reason why he is here. It shows how selfless this man was. We, we will miss him. We as members of the union will miss him very, very much. Mr. Payne, the man and the year. Mr. the year. So it must have been Bye-bye. Thank you. Thank you. Anybody? 
At this moment, we hear scripture reading. We call upon Papa to give us some little reflection. Hallelujah. Amen. I would say, I want to encourage you. I want to strengthen your faith. Uh, I want to re-energize your faith to keep on. Because you are catching the doctor saying here, echo. So shall my and then I'm just looking at the young guy, he's my friend. I'm sure he's also a friend to his grandpa. And a great responsibility has been placed on you. So this is the most important part of your life. How to manage, how to organize them, how to stabilize them, how to bring them together, how to direct them, how to instruct them. They need you the most in these times. So I want to encourage you and I want to I want to use I want to use Ruth and Naomi as an episode. I zoom in Ruth and Naomi as Naomi. So I'm coming from Ruth chapter one. Like, uh, look at Ruth chapter, chapter 1, verse 1. It was because of some incidents. That's why Papa, Mr. Elimelech, and Naomi, and the children travel. And you see that uh, the problem of Papa Nicholas Kinsey, Utia Mankwa, also has similar, similar direction, follow some, the same direction. It was a regime. It was when the judges ruled in Israel. When there was farming, there was problem. Papa Elimelech, and Mama Naomi, and Kelon, and the man said, okay, let's go, being directed by the father, Mr. Elimelech. Interestingly, they did go to Moab, and in some few days, the man passed away. Then the woman was left with the children. So they took wives in that city, and in no time, the young men also passed on. So, Mama Naomi was virtually left alone. No sons, no husband. So she had only in-laws. Ruth and Naomi. After 10 years, I would have whatever we are doing here is in the world. We are Zoom in the world. So uh, let us uh, actually give the world the best we can offer them. Hallelujah. So, Mama, I want to tell you that uh, in spite of the losses you have incurred, there's something in you that somebody needs. You can be a connector, you can be an organizer, you can give direction. So, here was a young lady. Who wanted to continue life and that was root so when the woman decided to go back because God had then visited Bethlehem again and Bethlehem stands for bread a place of bread baby no wonder Bethlehem became a place of the birth of Jesus Christ so when he she decided to go back both of them said, we'll go with you. Then the woman came back and said, 
listen, my daughters, if I am going to have children again when I go back to Bethlehem, can you wait for the sons to grow and marry them? No. Life has become bitter and bad for me. So stay with your people and let me go alone. Then Opa accepted the challenge, kissed the mother-in-law, left. Then Ruth remained alone and stood with the mother-in-law. And the mother-in-law said, look, your friend, your sister is going back to her people and her gods. Go with her. And Ruth said, Ruth said, do not force me to leave you. Where you go, I will go with you. Where you sleep, I will sleep. Where you die, I will die. Where you bury, I will be buried. Your people will be my people, and your God will be my God. Hallelujah. There was a God for Naomi, a living God who look on them and allow pains, allow the mind to die, allow the son to die. The same God was still God, and Ruth exercised some faith. And this God decided to follow Naomi. And then when Naomi saw that she was determined, she stopped talking. They go to Bethlehem, and the whole city was in uproar. And what they said was, hey, Naomi, the form has changed. Everything about Naomi has changed. And he said, don't call me Naomi. Call me Mara. For I went in full, but I have come back empty. Now, mommy, I'm going Some aspects of your life is empty. But there are some, see, some values in you that somebody is hungry for. There's still some life in you. There's still some wisdom in you. There's still some knowledge in you, which is so important. This man has finished his course. At times in our pains, we are connected to some people that we can lead them also to find their destination. And that was the, the woman. Her life was so critical. God was doing something with the woman. God was telling the world, the world to come that. God was telling the world to come that. Jesus was going to come into the world, and when Jesus came into the world, both the Gentiles and the Jews will worship the same God. So God decided that this, now, this root, even though she was a widow, her life was so important. I am about to add her to the important thing I was going to do in the world, but she needed a connector. Please, Mama, you are going to be a connector and advisor to these young ladies and gentlemen that Papa led into your care. So your life is vital. Your life is so important because the moment they got to Bethlehem and now they wanted to go to a place, some route, she went to the room and said, please, can I go to say, go. She left and the man said, it happened that she found herself in the farm of Boaz. She came back with abundance and the woman said, what did you do? Said, I, I found myself in the farm of Boaz, a man called Boaz. I said, oh, in my case, my redeemer. Well, you mean more jabu, more jankasa. That was the beginning of the bitter words of God in the land of Israel. And that Naomi would be in her portion and destiny. So the destiny of your, child, your children, the destiny of your grandchildren, the destiny of your great grandchildren are connected to you, so you are important. Please, leave Mr. Tell my wife alone. You just told me your wife said, I just want to go back and say, you want to go back and say, you want to go back and say, you want to go back and now we pass on it. Now for ye king and me as a mature. Is that said and like a year root what now you are saying what you call Moab. Now now we are quite sheer root. Now when you are or yam or many more so I say the end when you may God glorify you in these times. Hallelujah. So God is going to glorify you. But it can only happen, only faith is put to work. Only when you open your eyes, 
Only when you have time to listen. Because the moment you go to Bethlehem, it was action, it was business, it was destiny, it was destination. Eti Obaba come by Mamma Hina Meko, Nasa Mamma, Mamma Yama Gram Bompire dear, when you remember Fanny Swakasa. You say, What they need from you is a grandmother who can pray, a grandmother who can connect them to God, a grandmother who can offer direction. Remember, sir, Sir Can Naomi Nuha Nomuna, eh, Ruth is so a or Kobe, or Simba, Tanasi, Namikura, you see, and reward information. Do you know, say, the young ladies and gentlemen this time, what they know is Facebook. They only have information from Facebook and Twitter, but information for life they don't have. They say, I'm right here, but they have a lot of information, but they are not value for life. And the one in Penino, man in Penino, a map in a tiny pack of Sabrim, a Tifiopia Abraham, if you're not a bus bar. Every home needs a great woman and a great man. Hallelujah. One more child, you know, how he pure coffee about here, and he pack a seven to it's it was in and then Ruth listened to this message. And Okoy, Okoy, who are moving here, Ruth, Okoy, 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 and whatever I have to do, I will do. Or buy and or bobo my mina my name catch or catch my message in the coin city. What's it? We see the woman Ruth became a prophet or prophetess. What's it? Ruth chapter 3, verse 8. It was a sit down and wait until the man do something about this case. He will never rest. Ben by one who made that I just want to share the one more. Sit down and wait for what will happen next. Lo and behold, early in the morning, Mr. Boaz took a step and went to the, the gate of the city and sat down and waited for these people. Finally, when they sat, and the one who was to, supposed to marry Ruth said, I can't. He said, I am ready. I am ready to take out the responsibility and take the property of Ruth, the, the, the husband of Ruth. He did that. Now, one of the people obeyed. And I open Bell with Jesse. And I open Jesse, I will David. And I David, and so I will Solomon. And I Solomon, so I will war. I've been at that. No one knows if one, and then I want the Joseph will be so good. Pierre, yeah. And I'll come away, Mary. Or then I'm not here. And I use to kiss to feel mobile. So the work of Naomi in the life of Ruth is more remembered than her life. In the husband, because true root, a savior came into the world. Your life is important. Death can never stop your importance. And the baton has been given to you. Hold it, keep it, use it to empower, to direct, to guide, and at the end, glory will be given to Jesus. Hallelujah. Amen. 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 Amen.
Thank you. We're going to hear some from Ms. Lillian. in my father's house. If it is well not so, I should have told you. For I am going to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I shall come again and take you to myself. Amen. We need to be assured. And that is the assurance from God. It's a place that has been prepared. And I know Papa's place is his house is for his room has been prepared for. And so as Papa Reverend Ambassador said, don't get yourself worried. He is gone. He's got a better place to go. And anytime I used to say anytime we gather, he is not here with us. He is with our Lord. Each funeral, every funeral it's not normally for the one who is dead, but it's for us, those who are alive. That as we see, as we go on, that we may also prepare ourselves. We sing our next hymn, also all the my friend and he will lead us with that. Ah, see, may have 
So my free memorize my she We thank you for him as a person, for all his qualities, for all that he was able to give and receive during his life. Father, we entrust him into your hands, knowing that you alone are the one who is able to satisfy all the longings of his heart. Lord, you are the one who brings good one out of evil and out of death. You brought resurrection. You are the one who can bring something new out of Otiamankwa death. We pray for all of us who have been touched by Papa's life and death. Help us to hear what you are saying to us this moment. Turn us away from all that we know to be wrong. Help us to show love and understanding to those around us. Forgive us for any ways in which we may have hurt. Help us to know that you are always ready to forgive us and to offer us a new beginning when we turn to you. Keep us in your grace. Guide and protect us until with Papa and all your children we we'll find ourselves truly at home in your great love, one day, through Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. We hear our next hymn, song.
buat Time comes, we'll rise up again. You see, we've got it here, we mourn so long time. This pandemic has come. Our lives have changed. There's so many things that are happening in our lives. But one of the things I tell people, just step back. Look at yourself and ask yourself, who am I? What I am. One day, all of us will be lying here like that. But see, when you are there, what is left is dust. See, this body will leave. It is, it is not there. And so what God has given us on this earth is for us to love one another. And without that love, you see, we, we, we just pass by. And so today as we've gathered, I know it's, our hearts are so heavy, so heavy. Children, grandchildren, wife, brothers, friends. But that's one, only one thing that God reminds us today. That this body one day will come out from that grave. Let's assure that Papa is at a better place. As we gather here today, as we say goodbye to him, how is your own journey on this earth? You know, we are more about Papa's story. Those who know him, 
and I've known him for over 25 years. And he's a man of God. You see, one of the things he doesn't play with is with his God. No matter what happened, he's always known. He knows that there's somebody there with him. And at times, that's the joy. So when you see someone like this, lying here, quiet, what to moon on drink as a beer, none on Tiasi. And now what to moon on drink as a beer, none so that's a Tiasi because of the legacy he has left behind. And I know, yes, maybe he was an accountant, maybe he charged you, but he has done a lot of work. He has trained so many people. And above all, he loves his grandchildren. And that, that's one of the things. And so we need also the love, that's what I was talking about, the love for his grandchildren is beyond description. He loves them and he cares for them. So today, maybe before you leave, as we leave here, but until Friday when we meet again, to say final goodbye to him. <clears throat> Whatever journey, whatever path on which you are on. Try to re-examine yourself on this time of pandemic. He's gone. He's finished. I come in home. I come in and say, whatever it is for us, we need to be able to say, yes, one day I will be there also. And that is the message for us today. Papa has told us already. He said, let, let him go. His time has come. The rest is left for you. Let's hear our next year song. How can you
which follow. Mm. We don't know who is around about a mother's place. to sing for Papa. But the point is, the government rule is rule. And we need to follow that, please. Because otherwise, I will be in trouble. You will go away, and I will be in trouble. Okay? So, we are now going to have our final prayer, and then we will come back to the view. All right? So now let's come back to prayer. Let's come together. Let's remain silent for a moment. Let us pray. <clears throat> Living, loving God, give us joy deeper than sorrow as we thank you for all your children and especially for Nicholas Kingsley Utia Mankwa. We will now commit into your care and keeping. As we will sustain and fed at your table on earth. Welcome him at the banquets of your children in heaven. And we give thanks that for Nicholas Uchiamankwa, pain, sorrow are ended. Death, is have his past, and that he lives forever in your love and care. And since we all have been but a hair's breath, from death since birth. Teach us, O oh God, how close we are to the life in all its fullness which Christ alone can give. Let us be thankful that Jesus has sent his spirit to wipe away all tears from our eyes, to bind up our wounded spirit, to give us peace in the midst of our trouble, for he is with us now and always. Amen. Amen. Shall we all stand, those who are sitting? Shall we stand for one minute silent as we remain silent for a moment? As we, at this moment, commend our father, our husband, our grandfather, our friend into God's hands. Let's remain a minute silent. Nicholas Kensle Tiamankwa Nicholas Kensle Tiamankwa Nicholas Kensle Tiamankwa Intimate God, you are able to accept in us what we cannot even acknowledge. You have named us what we cannot bear to speak of. You hold in your memory what we have tried to forget. You hold out to us a glory we cannot imagine. And I heard a voice say, write this. 
Blessed are those who die in the name of the Lord. For their work will follow them. And now may the peace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God. And the sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit rest upon you. May he guide and direct you. And may he remain with you now and always. Papa, rest in peace. Until the day that the trumpet will sound. That all will be raised. To the glory of God, now and evermore. Amen. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Oh, yeah, you do. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Yes, you do. Oh, yeah. At this moment, as we sing it, those standing will come and have a view. Yes, Please, um, we stop because the, you know, Papa goes to the Pentecostal church. We I plan with them to be here at six, 
unless they just arrived. So let's give them a few minutes. They'll come here and sing one song, and then after they finish, then we do the viewing, and those who want to go can go. So please, have patience with us. So, um, only one person can sing, please. Let's obey government rule. No singing. You can hum, please.
Amen. Making <laughs> Na ni ma sahu mei a chenso ne moon samono a yen sama a wasa y kramono or de manu or de bakono manu y dano wedi shirani vieno bakon a be a san or se en shirani o nipa o king kind san semu a fein shirani nia o king kind san semu in so chirano. Na okura sa ansemu imu. Kwa si se, ensemu imu, a ah, wati nina anu, ebebe muwevi. Amen. Amen. Ose, 13, ose, I heard a voice from heaven saying, right, blessed are the dead who die in the Lord from now on. Yes, says the spirit, they will rest from their labor, for their deeds will follow them. Over Revelation 1, 7, 16, 7, 16, 17, or say, never again will they hunger, never again will they taste. The sun will not burn upon them, nor any scorching heat for the lamb at the center of the throne will be their shepherd. He will, he will lead them to spring of living water. And God will wipe away every tears from their eyes. Amen. Adolfo, and then you may hear the The son said, Sani ya yenye na yenye mwa ashasa mwa ni mwa ebra unyami bo ni pana omo ni pana mrasa mwa bo dintro mno mrasa mba akupe no ni pana dintro unyami dintro omo ni pana ni akani ni na omo ni pana mkuu nse ni pana mfanyia na siti na mu na unyasundi na ni ya eya ya na Obin to me in Chiremo, and it says, I'm ransom back of pain so, Nenia, in Busso. The sun so yame yen in yaminti. Nanya oka, a wasser bem. Nanya or she said, a wasser a genanti. Uba, unipasso. Na uba, unipasso. The sun so yame born in Chiremo, and son of bone nipentino. No, or don't near Chiremo, poor moon nipper. And into a moon nipper. Afi asano anka ho. Yedi kanyami yi ni dwedi. Se mri mwa anka se se nipa mwa jwane kotu ya ni nyami se. Ma yebone no. U nyanko po anka sa mwa. Efi fi u nipa wa yebone. Ni sanso dono. Na nyami dono chenso. No nimse. Na deja. Eye na oni nyami ya deja inti no. Kuma buwa di kata u nipa deja so. Na ni tia mwa. Na waso sumo bia wa mreni muno, e wase oba wa hunamfem. 
ni obi a oni e moja ana se ye mbusuye ni no wo ofi na nkasa pem no wo tumi se adie bia emra no hye no tumi de jiye no wo tumi ajiye ndine se se yesu kristo ye na je nkwa no oba ane me mu no ni ese so be ye bia oye na o de kwan to ho se sa se bone be ndi e de bi o ni pa pese o twi ne ho fi bone ho na o san ba ni nya no nche no e wo so o ji o ni e wa di yesu christ di no pe mu ka ame ye no ba e ni ndi e na nyumre ye sia mo ha sa mre ni na ye papa o ti a no ye ye ni na papa pe ko pe Asi tre mu mira mu lo ti nya mi asa mu ti asa no am pa o mu ti ni mu akra bre mu nya no wa se mi o ka se o se sa de chi me na mi tumi sori jira mi na so e tumi ko ya mi ka po ti no mu dia e ni ni ti bi a se nya mi ya o ti fu si a ta mo se mi tumi ka wo mu ni le mu po ね、パセ。ね、ピアノはせせ。え、パセ。え、わそわばパンバンゴケティア。おもごでそばパス。あなたも。あどこにあめけんにな、ねせ。え、ね、やパパ、おりえねじゅま。ま、みじゃもにも
You don't waste too much time, you said. And the weather no, it's not favorable to us. I'm back on Friday. Uh no we see no. I'm saying money and money information.
and even great grandchildren. At this day, we lift up our hands and our voice and we say thank you, Jesus, for the great and mighty things you have done. Thank you that out of this one seat, we have had children and grandchildren. At this time, we pray for the children. We ask that the blessings that were upon our daddy will be granted to them in the name of Jesus. We pray that whatever our daddy, our grandfather could not achieve, may it come upon the children in the name of Jesus. Amen. We pray that you bless them with longevity. Amen. We pray that before any of them depart, they will also see their children and their children's children. Amen. We ask of God for divine comfort to be their portion. Amen. It's not easy to be separated from your father, and most especially your grandfather. Father, the love that was between our father and the grandchildren, we pray that it's only the Holy Spirit that yes. can fill that God. Amen. Comfort the children. I know how Evelyn loved the father. I know how the children also love their grandfather. I pray that you, who is the comforter, will comfort them in the morning, in the afternoon, and in the evening. Amen. Bless them. Make them successful in life. In the name of the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, let everybody say good night. Amen. So let us receive the last grace of the Lord. Now, as you came here, when the time comes for you to go away, and you go in peace, and God love be with you, and He guide your driving, your walking, and whatever you be, taking you home. And now may the peace of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God. The sweet fellowship of the Holy Spirit rests upon you. May he guide and direct you. May he remain with you now and always. Go in peace and serve the Lord in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Thank you all for coming. Thank you very much. Um, it's still looking to those who are just arriving. We are so blessed. So those of you who want to go, thank you so much. And those who are just arriving, you are really so blessed. Thank you. 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 Also, by the Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Yeah,
I mean, Sunday. But I think they were probably. Hold on. Do you understand? Do you understand? No, stand there. Stand there. Okay, yeah. all right, that's fine. Mm. Mm. Okay, all right. Ready? Ready? Um. Um. Can you just yes. stand here a bit? Yes, let me see if I can. Thank you. Oh, thank you.